Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Melissa, otherwise known as Mewlissa or Mew. And today we're back playing part number 14, I believe, of the Harry Potter Legacy Challenge in The Sims 4. And where we are now is the birthday of little Clara. Um, everybody forgot about it. She just aged up on her own, so she's currently kind of crying in her bedroom. Um, she's been given an air mattress to sleep on, just kind of... She put together this stack of boards to put a broken lamp on, and that's pretty much all she owns. So, she's not feeling too good about herself. Here, let's take a shower, actually. Um, I will show you. Um, I redid the house a little bit, like redecorated it. This is the parents' room. I don't remember if I showed you these rooms or not, but they're pretty self-explanatory. Oops, I forgot to get rid of rid of this high chair. We don't need that anymore. Okay. And then downstairs. Come in. Here's a welcome mat. Um, place to put your keys. There's some keys right there. The plug mob keychain. Um, walk through here. And there's actually a telephone right there that is not usable, but it's there. And then here's the living room. It's very tiny, very quaint. I kind of thought that these could be maybe some cross stitches that, um, what's your name again? Elaine did. Um, here's our cute little kitchen. Isn't it beautiful? And then over here is the new dining area. Um, and then I think my favorite room is probably this room, even though it's got some trash in it right now. Whoops. Um, I like it a lot. It's the study. Um, I just like this bookshelf in particular. Um, I got to place all these items individually and I just think they're all really cute and looks just realistic. So yeah, and we got different bathroom parts because I wanted it to go with the rest of the house. I kind of wanted it to look kind of like the Dursley's home. So that's kind of what I was going for. Um, these two, Iris and Ian, are going to age up in a couple of days. Two days. But I think I might age them up now. Or tomorrow, maybe. Maybe like one day early. Just because I don't want them to be the same age as Clara for very long. And yes, Salem is still on our butts trying to get us to hang out with him. And we have been working on our writing, so we have quite a few books published right now. Ooh, that one was worth a lot. That's awesome. Did you guys do your homework? You can do your extra credit if you wanted, but probably don't want to. I'm so mad at her. Shut up! Here comes Clara. Um, confirm the verbal. Um, this is her outfit. It's just a white t-shirt, some ripped jeans, and some, um, kind of old, muddy, stained-looking boots. Her, I didn't, I only did this and her, um, her sleepwear. So, where is her sleepwear? So, this is what it looks like. I'll show you. Probably mismatched, mismatched socks and probably an old t-shirt of Elaine's. So, yeah, nothing too special. But there she is. I'm going to have her do her homework. Sorry for the rumbling outside. I don't really know what's happening. But, yeah, I just kind of wanted to catch you up on the family a little bit. Give you a day in the life when she's a kid. And then I'll give you a day in the life when she's a teenager. <laughs> and then, um, yeah. We need to change her last name to Benali. Benali. Should we? I don't know. She can be a Metzara, I guess. Well, no. Yeah. This is your dad. He's creative too. That was one of the things that we needed to use as a trait, um, creativity. She also got the happy toddler trait from having level three toddler skills. Um, so that's really nice that we have that. That'll help us inch forward in the future. 
Um, so yeah. Almost done with their homework. Okay, and then, perfect. We're gonna go ahead and, we've got a skill level to level two already. Oh, we sure do. Let's go ahead and draw a little bit. Looks like everybody else is going to bed, so we'll go to bed pretty soon here. But while everybody else is asleep, we're gonna take this opportunity to draw. And here we've got a picture of Elaine and Peter. I wanna get a picture of Ian and Iris as well to hang up on the wall. Okay, and then she's gonna hang this up in her room. Ooh, we got a promotion, pro gamer. Nice. Almost done. He needs some fun. Let's have him use the bathroom and then come play incredible sports. Let's put this in our inventory and hurry up and get out of here before Peter sees us here. Probably won't be very happy with us. Um, auto lights, all lights. We'll hang this on the wall. Right there. And we can go to sleep. Peter does not like us very much. Okay, getting some fun in our lives. I think he said we got a poster or something. So let me grab that. Where is it? Load faster. Thank you. That's a cool poster. Oh wow, it's worth a lot of money, especially for how poor we are right now. <laughs> That's perfect. <clears throat> oh, perfect. So we need to get to the next level of the gaming skill and the next level of the programming skill. Fair enough. Fair enough. Alright, who's calling? If it's Salem, I swear. Okay, no, it's not. Okay, is your fun? Okay, let's wait till this is completed and then we'll go to sleep. Should be completed in just a second. There we go. Okay, go to sleep. Go to sleep. Oh, Ian's awake. I'm gonna go get some food, okay. And once you're done with that, you can use the bathroom and take a shower. Today's Friday. Um, no, that's a little inappropriate, Dad. That I don't know. Why weren't you able to use the bathroom? She's awake. She's gonna come have some fish and chips. Okay, perfect. She's gonna come watch a movie. No, you can go sit there. You don't need to chat with her. <clears throat> Come use the bathroom and take a shower. You're almost done. Okay, perfect. You can go ahead and play dolls. Both Iris and Ian have A's. They're straight A students, so that's really cool. Um, they have vacation days. That's funny. Um... She just started school, obviously she just aged up, so she's just a C student right now. Creativity level three, very nice. And you got what, what was that? You got creativity level three. Cool, 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 cool. Um, can you go put him away please? 
you can come sit down and watch Channel Surf. Okay, so school starts in an hour for everybody. Yen is off to school, okay. She should be going to school. She should be going to school as well. Congratulations on your recent birthday. Aww. Thanks, Dan. Study hard, study hard. She's just gonna work normally. She's not too much of an academic. Who's here? If it's Salem. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's the gardener. I was like, what is that? It's a ghost. Okay, let's go play some Sims Forever. You are rested, so you need to wake up and have something to eat. Oh, it's his birthday today. Okay. Why isn't it her birthday then? Nice. We're getting more money. Perfect. Look at those curtains blow. Wow. Wow. Okay, and then go ahead and use the bathroom and take a shower. I can't believe I'm doing another legacy challenge. It's going to take forever to finish this. <laughs> and I know it. Because I did the regular legacy challenge. The Disney princess right le Not a regular legacy challenge, the Disney princess legacy challenge. And that was a challenge. Okay, use the bathroom, please, for the third time. And you can then practice programming. Okay, and now you need to write another book. Oh, no, resume writing, I guess. Oh, you level seven already, okay. Well, that was easy. Oh. That's there, okay. Just throw that in here. And you can now play a game. Huh? Play incredible sports instead, so we can get to level eight. Okay. And our garden is coming along. We're making quite a bit of money off of it. It's really helpful. I appreciate it. It's mostly Peter's work. He doesn't really... Nobody else really does anything. I feel like once Claire's a teen, that'll be part of her chores, is to do gardening. Uh, C student. A student. A student. It's almost Ian's birthday. Okay. <laughs> When is your birthday? Isn't it your birthday soon? <laughs> Two days. Okay, that's weird that you guys aren't the same age. I guess, oh, it's because you were pregnant. That's right. These two are going to do their homework straight away. You cannot play with that toy. That is not your toy. You're not allowed in there. We are going to... I wish you could lock for everyone, like, keep unlocked for everyone, like, just lock for her, if that makes sense. Lock door for, um, hold on, lock door for everyone but Iris, allow access to, allow access to Ian, allow access to, oh, shoot. Unlock. Sorry, I messed that up. Lock door for everyone but Iris. Allow access to Ian. Allow access to Elaine. Allow access to Peter. Okay, and then same for this one. Lock door for everyone but Ian. Allow access to Iris. Allow access to Elaine. And allow access to Peter. 
Now this one is just going to be the parents' room. Locked door for everyone but Peter. Allow access to Elaine. Okay. We'll probably just lock this for just her. I don't see why not. Everyone but Clara. There. Go ahead and go have something to eat. Peter starts working out. It's almost Iris's birthday. Hey, do your homework out there. Come over here and do it. Elaine finished her book and Iris finished her homework. Or maybe Ian did. I don't remember which one I saw. I guess it was Ian and Iris finished it. Okay. So they both finished their homework. <coughs> and sell that to the publisher. You can stop. You can stop talking to him and go publish your book. Okay. And now we will sell this. Publish 10 books. We're getting there. Okay, I need her to make some food. Because we have mostly just spoiled food in here. That's two left. That's done. So you're going to serve dinner. Um, garlic noodles. Claire is now social level three. Nice. She needs to go take a nap. I don't really know what else to do with her. <coughs> Throw that in there. You just ate, I guess, so you can go use the bathroom. I can go in there. Okay. And eat that. I don't know why they suddenly have started to just put one serving in their pocket instead of taking it to the table and sitting down with it. It's so weird. It's so weird. Okay. You're having fun, but you also need to use the bathroom. And then open this up and have, we'll grab a serving of that. How are you doing? You're doing fine. Just fine. Why don't you train your void critter? Nymphaea, or whatever it is. No, 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 no. Put it down, put it down, put it down, put it down. Whew, that was close. That was really close. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna have you come right again. Um, I think nonfiction. <laughs> Pretty sure would be good. And then he's gonna go to sleep once he's done. The Fox of Park Avenue, sure, sounds good. Okay, and don't clean up after yourself, please. Please, 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 please. Dang it. Go sleep. Go to sleep. Why did you go the long way around? That was weird. Weirdo. How are you doing? You need to go to sleep. And you are getting to the point where you need to go to sleep. Let me have you stop writing your book and then go to sleep. Low social? Okay, well, guess who cares? Not me. Okay, everyone's asleep, so where's- Oh, Peter aged up! Oh, crap, I forgot to give him his cake. Sorry, buddy. He's gonna be sad now. Yeah, forgotten birthday. Sorry, bud. Sorry. Come tend your garden, that'll make you feel better. Right? Right? And evolve, and evolve, and evolve. Oh, and evolve. 
and evolve. I might have selected a few twice. Oh well, better safe than sorry, you know? You know what I'm saying? Yes. No. You can wake up and use the bathroom and take a shower. Yep, you still live here. I know it's a nightmare. Perfect. Once you're done, you can use the bathroom and then grab a serving of that. Go on. Do as I say, not as I do. What are you doing? You're grabbing that. Hold on, wait for him to grab his first. Or just take it, that's fine. You probably just took his last piece. Yeah, you did. Uh oh. Uh oh, spaghetti yo. He's gonna yell at her for doing that. Also, he's sad because of his forgotten birthday, so. Lauren, Kajul, not a drim. Scridge! Yikler. Spinach? <laughs> Yell again. Just keep Lauren. yelling. That's also for taking my food. I was looking forward to that breakfast scramble, you little brat. Do your homework after that. Oh yeah, she's like, I'm getting out of here. <laughs> I don't want to be here. Let's see, is today your guys' birthday? Yes. It is. Isn't it for you two? Yes. Okay, I'm gonna have her come down and make you a cake then. Um, cook. We'll just make a regular white cake. Oh, she's so sad. I'm sorry. I'm excited to see what these guys look like. They're like Asian gingers. It's so unheard of. Clara finished her homework. Okay, perfect. Ugh, don't put it in the fridge. Why do you do this? Why do you do this? Why? Open. Open sesame. Put it there. Add birthday candles. Okay, and we'll have Ian go first. Okay. He will be about knowledge. And I want him to be kind of hot headed. Okay, add birthday candles. Okay, your turn, Iris. Come blow out your candles. Come on. See, she's self-assured. I see her as also being hot-headed, but let's see. Maybe she'll be athletic. And active. No. Maybe she'll be... Kind of mean, maybe? Yeah, we'll have her be mean. Okay, throw that in there. And let's go ahead and modify them and cast. They look like they're not bad, actually. Okay, boys first, because they're boring. Oh my gosh, stop it. Stop it. Hmm. Can't 
can't take you seriously, especially with that voice. <laughs> Bukana. I like that voice, yes. Okay, so not as Asian as I anticipated, which is good. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of viewed him with the Harry Styles hair. Yeah. Let's see, he's hot headed and a genius. Yeah, perfect. This looks very British to me. <laughs> Kim, I'm sorry if that's rude to say, but it does. It really does. Um, and then we'll get you some of these guys. Uh, maybe in the tan, yeah. Look at him, he's so cute. I know he's supposed to be a jerk, but he's so cute. Um, sleep and see. We'll give him this in mm -hmm. gray. Take the shoes off and give him mm, these. Yeah, I like that color on him too. We'll give him the gray or maybe the black. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Okay, now her turn. Oh wow, she's, wow. She's really pretty. Uh-oh, she's got the, the Hannah hair. If you watch Little Simsy 100 Baby Challenge, you know what I mean. I'm kind of, I've kind of been a fan of this hair lately. I don't know why, but I just have. But her hair was more like straight when she was younger, so I feel like this would be more her thing. I don't like that particular shade uh -huh. though. Yeah, we'll go for that. And let's give her the eyebrows that I prefer. There we go. And we need to slap some eyelashes on her. There we go. She's gorgeous. Wow. Good for her. Oh yeah, I want to give them both freckles. Um, freckles for men? Somewhere? Anywhere? Nowhere? Really? Oh, here we go. Cool. doing your makeup sorry eyes go for these ones oh you would never know there was like a different color to them oh I like that oh I like it okay some lipstick maybe some just lip gloss yeah that's nice okay she is self-assured She's into working out. Ooh, I kinda like this. Um. Mm. go and give her I have a oh these might be good actually and white yeah I'm not digging the eyeshadow anymore however something a little lighter there we go and then for sleepwear Gotta slap on those eyelashes again, take that makeup off. Okay, and let's see. My favorite sleepwear right now is this. I love it. Although I feel like this should be her Clara's when she ages up. She's probably gonna wear something a little bit nicer to sleep. Maybe not, <sighs> maybe not totally, but snooze before dudes. She 
shave my legs for this? Boys, whatever, cats forever. <laughs> Wine is my Valentine. Well, she's a little too young for that, so maybe we'll go for this. Or even this? I kind of like this. It's cute. Yeah, with the bunny slippers is fine. Let's give her a flirtatious walk. Ooh. We'll give him a serious <laughs> walk. Yeah, he's a bro. He's a bro for show. Okay. And then I'm gonna need to redo their bedrooms, but I will do that off screen. And you'll probably see them next time when Clara is a teenager. All right, very cute. They are adorable. Look at him. Oh, I just, I love him. Change into your everyday, buddy. <laughs> oh my gosh, stop, stop it. I wanted to get their picture as children, dang. Let's get them to take a picture together now. Take a photo with Iris. Mom will be in the background. Nice, classic. Okay. Let me just pause that and hold this up. Put it up here. This is normal, okay. Okay, add the frame, delete the rest, delete that. We could give the void critters to our little half-sister, but we're not going to. And then I just need to change the color of this and move this up a little bit. Perfect. Family photos are fun. All right. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, don't forget to leave a like or a comment down below. If you really enjoyed it, hit the subscribe button. Um, recently found out that my dad is doing better at YouTube than I am, and he is 73 years old. So help me beat my dad on YouTube. <laughs> He's, he shouldn't be better at it than me. He just shouldn't. Okay. <laughs> Um, anyway, I'll see you guys all next time. Thanks for watching. Bye guys. Hey guys, it's been like 20 minutes and I was gonna wait to show you their bedrooms once they, once Clara aged up, but then I realized that these two would be adults and they'd be out of the house and so what would be the point? So I wanted to show you guys their bedrooms because I'm really proud of them and I really think they're adorable. So we'll start, let's see, let's actually like go into tab mode, you know? You know, wee. Okay, so we will do Ian's room first. We'll go into his room. And first thing you see when you come in the door is this little guy and the thing study. Um, it says the act of texting, eating, and watching TV when something, I don't know. <laughs> it's a joke, but. Um, He's the nerd brain, so yeah, and then I thought he'd be like a little history buff, so I'm like pointing at the screen like you can see, but you can't, but he has that little guy there that I thought would be like something out of, like some history kind of thing. And then over here, we've got a calendar, um, this like little reading promotion, um, the Harry Potter poster, which I thought was really ironic. Um, he's got a stormtrooper up there. He's got a computer. Um, here's like his shoes and like his like little organizer, just like stuff that he is reading and m maybe not Vogue, but um, <laughs> I'm pretending those like his textbooks and stuff. And then here's his bed. It's very plain up there. I've got like a, a science-y photo. Maybe it's like some sort of, I don't know. I don't know what it would be. But here we've got Shakespeare up there, 
Um, we've got a globe and his wallet, some beats, more textbooks. And then I thought it was really funny. This is kind of gross, but I add lotion and Kleenex because he's a boy. And I'm not going to explain anything else beyond that. So there's that. That's Ian's room. And then we will go into um, Iris's room. So she's into... She's into um, sports, so this is some sports posters above her bed, and then she's also still a good studier, so she's got the little study planner thing as well, some magazines, a calendar, coffee mug, um, and then a cute little picture there. There's her um, soccer lamp with the TV remote, because he got a computer, she got a TV. I thought that was only fair. Um, and then up here, she's got a signed jersey, a soccer poster and I wanted to put something else up here and I couldn't think of what there wasn't really anything else that I could think of that was like kind of um, soccer -y or sporty I mean and so I thought maybe like her dad would have come home after like a gaming uh, game con or something like that with uh, this poster and he would have offered it up and she probably would have been the one to like accept it first because she likes playing the sims <laughs> And then just her wardrobe here with just some little knickknacks and some um, perfume. And then here's her mirror with a couple pairs of shoes, her like sports shoes, just some regular Converse and a basketball. So yeah, I'm going to put a, I haven't put it out there yet, but I'm going to put a basketball hoop in the front yard. But that is their rooms. So I hope you enjoyed. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys all next time. Bye, guys.